What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Derek the Gator here. It's been a very, extremely long time since I've uploaded a video to my channel. But um, I wanted to let y'all know, hey, we're doing good. We're doing great. Um, everything's fine. We're just very extremely busy people, just like, you know, most of you are, just like we all are, kind of. Um, but, hey, you know, we we just roll with the punches, man, and we just keep it moving and do the best we can and i want to tell all of y'all that you know life gets difficult it's not always easy you have your good times you have your bad times and you have your times where it just seems like everything's just coming down on you but hey get through the day stay strong and hey man you, you, you'll come out of it all right I, i'm just i'm going through all this i'm saying this because you know my job is giving me the blues man it's really giving me the blues but I have faith that things are going to get better because trouble don't last always. I was always taught that. So, uh, hey, man, I, you know, I'm keeping my, my keeping my head up and and I'm I'm actually excited because I'm actually got some vac vacation time coming up. So I'm going to have some time to myself. I'm going to get myself together. I'm going to rest, spend time with family, something that I enjoy doing. And I'm planning on uploading some videos in the meantime, too. Well, during my vacation. So uh, this is the first one. Once again, welcome to the channel. My name is Derek the Gator. Um, for those of you who are watching, you know, any videos on this channel for the first time, watching this video, uh, I like to do a lot of unboxings and anything out there in the wild that uh, I find cool, you know, if it's affordable because nobody gives me anything for free, <laughs> you know, I uh, bring it here. I like to unbox it for you and, you know, have a little fun with it. So today... Let's get to it. Hanging out, you know, doing a little shopping with the family. My my oldest daughter runs to me. We're in the checkout line and she brings me something. And she's like, hey, dad, you want this? And I look at it and I was like, what, what, what is this? And she brings me this. Now, of course, it looks like a Game Boy, right? But uh, let's see, what what company is this? Mercury? At the top, he says, arcade fun. Now, I'm going to tell you something. Whenever I see anybody use the term arcade, I get a little, you know, I, I get a little sensitive because I grew up in, you know, the, the 90s. So when someone used the term arcade, I'm thinking of like an arcade, like, you know, you go to a shopping mall and you have all the arcade cabinets and pinball machines and all that kind of stuff. So, OK, I don't I don't take the word arcade lightly. OK, that's near and dear to my heart. But apparently, this device has 200 games preloaded on it. All right. Now, um, I mean, it does. It, it has a little bit of a weight to it. I did pay basically 10 bucks for this. It was 9.98 at Walmart. Um, let's take a little tour around the box real quick. I already showed you the front. Uh, portable game console, 200 games. Let's see what it says on the side here 200 games uh rechargeable battery so uh, you don't need double a's or triple a's or anything that's very good easy to carry well i hope so i mean look how small it is it's actually smaller than a game boy um and it comes with av cable so you can plug into your tv now i'm not going to do all that because i think the tv i currently have does <coughs> excuse me doesn't have a, a av connection in the back all right so we're going to unbox this thing and we're going to see, hopefully the battery, the rechargeable battery does have some juice because I would like to show you what kind of games are on this thing. And I'm very curious. 200 games? 200? I would think at, at, at least a, half of those games, 100, 100 of those games would be decent, right? What kind of games are we going to get on this? Are we going to get those uh, boo-boo shovelware games that, you know, that are blatant ripoffs of real games? Like... So, yeah, I want to get into it. Let's unbox this thing first. All right. Had to cut the tape off of the top there. Open it up. All right. Comes with some uh, bubble wrap. So they actually care about this device. They don't want it to get damaged. Oh, before I get to that, let's see what, what else is in the box. Got your USB for charging. That's good. Got your AV cables, so you can plug it into a television. 
And that's everything that's in the box. Oh, on the box, let's see. On the back of the box, enjoy 200 classic games in a compact and lightweight design. Choose from retro arcade games, puzzles, shooting, racing, fighting, adventure, and more. Great while traveling, camping, commuting, or simply relaxing anywhere. Plus, you can easily connect to your television for an even, even bigger, better gaming experience. Mm hmm. Okay, look at that. I'm, is that supposed to be Link from Zelda? What is that? You got a, a little dinosaur. I don't know who that is. I, I, okay, whatever. All right. So, so now we got the little device here. Let's take it out of the bubble wrap. You got your your little manual. All right. It shows you how to turn it on, charge it, all that kind of stuff. Maybe with some warranty information. I got a little battery cover on the back here. What is this? That's your rechargeable battery in there. All right. But it doesn't feel too bad. Like, uh, the D-pad is a little on the squishy side. It doesn't have that little popping, you know, that little sturdiness to it. Uh, face buttons aren't bad either. It's, 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 it's okay. I mean, for 10 bucks, I mean, you, you, you're not going to get like an, an analog pocket. You Come on. Uh, what button is that? Home button, probably? I guess that's the home button. You got your start and select. Directional. Your face buttons. There's your little speaker. On top, I guess that's your on and off switch. Uh, in the middle, that's where you connect your USB for charging. And is that a headphone jack? Yeah, I like a I like the headphone jack. Okay, that's cool. That's welcome nowadays. That's that's a good thing. So let's see if this thing actually turned on or do I have to charge it? Hmm. All right. Where's the it's <laughs> the volume. Oh, the volume locker. Good dollars on the side there. Turn that down. Okay. Uh, now, we've all seen things like this, right? The little uh, 201 preloaded deals. You know, I kind of figured that's what this was going to be, right? But, I mean, hey, for $10, though. I mean, it was only $9.98. What kind of, let's see what kind of games we got on this thing. Now, just a little bit more. All right, let's 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 go through the Twin Fish, <laughs> Twin Fish Turtles One, Fantasy Zone, Snow Brothers. Wait a minute, that, those those are, that's an actual game. Final Mission, Octopus, Excite Bike. So are there actual Nintendo games on here? Popeye, Space Invaders. All right, let's let's click on one and see what's what this thing is all about. Let's see what uh, Ninja One is. Let's see how you start this. Okay. Guess I'm not gonna see what Ninja One is. This is. I mean, this could be something that's actually cool, man. All right. Well, let's see what Turtles 1 is. Anything that has Turtles on it, you would assume that it's Ninja Turtles. That's the music. Yeah, that's, that's Ninja Turtles for the NES. <laughs> okay, this, this could be something cool. Let's see. All right, let's check out Snow Brothers. Well, all right. I, I like I said, if half of these games are actual decent games, I'm I'm not gonna be mad about this purchase for ten bucks. Already preloaded, ready to go.
I, I you know, um, I, I, I'm, I'm not disappointed so far. Now I'm pretty sure there are a lot of these game, a lot of these games on here, all those boo boo games, like you know, some kind of flash whack a mole or you know, you know, some stupid stuff like that. But there's actual NES games on here. Okay, ten bucks, at, at least fifty to hundred actual NES games. Thumbs up. The screen is like a, I would say maybe a three inch screen, a three inch uh, diagonal screen. It's, it's, it's a decent size and the size of a whole unit. You can easily, you know, put it in your shirt pocket, whatever like that, or in your back pocket. The build is actually decent. The plastic isn't all squishy and it's not hollow feeling. And as you can hear, the, the speaker is very loud. Huh, I, I'm, I'm. I'm impressed. I'm not in love with it, but this this could have gone a whole lot worse than than this. I'm just looking at the list of games on here. Of course, a lot of these games have weird names, but you can look at some of the names and you can kind of assume what they actually are. But yeah, a lot of these a lot of these titles are actual real game titles. Like I have no idea what Crystal Blast is or Ghost Castle. What is Ghost Castle? Is that like Castlevania or something? Ghost Castle. It, it looks like Castlevania. No, that's not Castlevania. But yeah, I don't know. I don't know what that is. See, that's that's an example of you know probably one of those boo boo games, or maybe Ghost Castle is an actual game that I just I'm just not familiar with. But the quality of it is actually it looks good. Okay, all right. But what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go through these these games and um, hey, until Excite Bike is this actual Excite Bike? Yeah. <laughs> you got the, you got all these NES games on the go, like you know. Of course, there's so many other ways you can go about you know something like this. You know, you can preload your own games to an SD card, you know, using your PC and, you know, there's so many other ways you can do this, but this is already put together for you. Um, I found it at Walmart. I can't say it's going to be at your local Walmart or, uh, or, you know, I, you may be able to find this on eBay, Amazon, things like that, but yeah, here it is. Mercury Arcade Fun Portable Game Console. Never heard of Mercury, but there you go. Not bad. Ten dollars. All right, I'll bite. <laughs> but yeah, man. Hey, thank you so much for watching. I hope this week is a total blessing for you. All right. I don't know what you have to face this week, and I I may not know you personally, but you know, make the make the most of this week. Stay safe. Protect your loved ones, and I hope to see you back on this channel soon okay um i'm looking forward to you know some time off i have coming up this week and i hope to upload a you know a couple more videos if you're not a subscriber uh, you know hit that notification bell for uh some future videos i have i do have some past content that i would like you to check out and thank you so much for watching this is Derek the gator signing out have a great week y'all good night oh he really wants me to play some excited bike all right have a good night y'all thank you so much for watching Y'all take care.